Hello and welcome to the XG Tutorials. Um, today we're just going to be doing a quick video on Sony Vegas. Um, most of you might have it. Some of you are Windows Movie Makers, which pretty much you won't really need this that much. This is for the people maybe doing gaming, maybe just doing videos like this and doing some colour correction kind of things. So I'm going to go straight onto the laptop. Okay then, so we've got the laptop all set up. So what you're going to do is... So I'm going to show you the, the setup for things. So we've got... 960 by 540 uh, that's just the YouTube length um, of the whole screen so you get no black marks you got the low field normal uh, 1000 square pixel aspect ratio uh, zero output rotation don't mess with that uh, frame rate 29.970 which is NTSC out of all of them you should find that 8 bit pixel format I think, no no I kept that the same actually uh, that doesn't be changed. Best, obviously, uh, full res resolution rendering quality. Motion, uh, you can have, uh, I don't know what how to spell that, I won't even uh, announce that. Or that one, it doesn't really matter, I just have this one anyway. Uh, adjust source, doesn't really matter. Um, start of all, new, don't think I messed with the audio. Uh, no. So apply all that. And we're gonna quickly get two, oh well, I don't even need that. Um, so, Let's try and find some. All this is just been editing the montage for National Stream Gaming. Oh, just wait for that load. So we got. Uh, let's just pick um, that one. So let's just see there. Uh, will this work? Uh, so basically, you want to go to properties first, and you want to go to disable resample. That makes the rendering quicker and maintain aspect ratio gone. Uh, so this doesn't work as good with that, so I'm just going to quickly steal some footage from Modern Warfare 2. Uh, look at uh, what can we use. We use the clutch. It's always the good one. Uh, I can. Oh, got to click it. <laughs> what I'm out about. So we've got the clutch, which you've already seen probably if you've known my National Stream game. I'm just going to get the colour in because you need the colour basically. So you go to properties, go to disable resample. Go to my and so you got that. So you can still see these black uh, lines on the side there. If you can see them just let me get my finger in, just here. So what you want to do for that is pretty much go to uh, view event pan crop, and then you see like you've got your screen there. Just move the thing. I've I've made a, a saved one uh, called cropped. What you do basically is move it in. So like that, and then move that in. And if it's got the top, it has. Sometimes it does have the top, and then just save it as like cropped. So that's cropped. So then now you look at it; it's fully all around the edge here. There's no black line, so it makes it pretty much full screen. And then the best one you want to go to uh, the effects bar, which you can either right click if you're faster there, or you can just go onto the end of the little uh, clip. So you want to go to, you want to click on add Sony Sharpen and Sony Color Corrector. I've already saved one, but what you want to do, <coughs> uh, I want to move off that. So if I go to a part, so if you look at that now, move it up a little bit. So if you look at that and then you watch the difference when I add you can see it, it might only be slight on this, but if you if I don't know, if I put it into a better colour, so if I click it, it, it kind of brightens it up. If you can see that, and then so what you want to do for that, in it's in colour corrector. So I want to zoom out again, zoom into this. So at the bottom, basically, all you want to do is go right down to the bottom of it, and then look at saturation, and then just put one point nine zero zero. And I hope I think that's it. Yeah, literally all you got to do is put uh, 1.900. It's already on one. Then save it as anything you want. And then uh, the sharpen is just pretty much just a a bit of extra sharpness, kind of I'd say, to the thing, which is only uh, 0 0.010. 